Hi, Yarnabees. It's me, Sandy. I wanted to do this video. Um, it's just going to be a quick video. Um, I got some sad news that, you know, Jeanette from Miss Hootie Hooten and Crafts is having a really hard time right now. Um, I think I mentioned in one of my videos a while back that <clears throat> I had a, um, an opportunity, a business opportunity to send my, um, jewelry and crochet and everything, all, all the products that I make down to the States in Pennsylvania uh, to a shop where she was, it was going to be a month, monthly thing where I would send her a box every month. Um, and I was really looking forward to this business opportunity. And then I found out, uh, well, this, this lady, her name is Sarah. She is Jeanette's cousin. Okay. Jeanette told got me this opportunity and I'm so thankful and um I it it just breaks my heart um this lady had gone through so much uh health wise she had a very successful shop she was busy 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 um, she's a go-getter. She's, you know, um, she's from what I, we had a very sh brief, um, encounter, you know, talking and stuff like that. And she sounded like a really nice lady. She battled cancer, breast cancer, uh, and she won, <clears throat> you know, she was, you know, she went in when, when I met her, um, she was, I didn't know this it until I didn't hear from her and Jeanette had let me know that she was going in for breast reconstructive surgery. So I thought, oh, wow, like that's a big surgery, you know, like, okay. So I was sending her messages saying, you know, I hope you're, you're doing well. Um, and, you know, try to take it easy and, you know, trying to be encouraging. And <clears throat> so she came out of the surgery and the surgery was a success. She was healing. And, um, I, I guess family members were taking care of the shop for her, including Jeanette. Um, and they all got COVID. Jeanette didn't get it, I don't think. But the rest of the family members and staff got COVID. Um, and unfortunately, Sarah got COVID. Because she was healing from her surgery, she was still really weak. And her body couldn't fight the COVID. She got pneumonia. And a couple of days ago, she passed away. Um, Jeanette's in this. Jeanette and her were very close. And to make matters even worse, her uncle died the same day. <clears throat> you guys, I, if you guys ha don't have, aren't subscribed to Jeanette's channel, please do. Please go over and subscribe and show her some support. This girl, she is very dear to my heart. Um, she has had such tragedy in her life this year. 
Her nephew passed away suddenly from a horrific car accident just a couple months ago. Um, and the family was reeling from that still. And then this happens. And <clears throat> Jeanette's health has been up and down like crazy. Jeanette was just in the hospital not too long ago. Um, so it's just, it floors me what's happening right now. You know, everybody seems to be having health issues, medical issues, and people are pa passing away. And it, it's, it's all around me right now. And I'm just going, oh, good Lord. I'm just, my heart hurts so much for Jeanette and Jeanette's family. I wish I could be there to just wrap my arms around her. And I, the family is just devastated by all of this. And I just can't even imagine. I can't even imagine. So I just wanted to send this out to Jeanette and say, honey, I love you with all of my heart. I am thinking about you every day. You must be getting sick of my messages bothering you all the time. Um, I just, I wish I could be there for you. Um, like physically be there, you know, <clears throat> and help you. Um, oh, so please, I've, Jeanette's, I do, um, a segment all, all year I've been doing a segment with her, um, called the 12 Project Collab, the Be Hootiful Pro, mm, Be Hootiful 12 Project Collab. Uh, so her link is always, <clears throat> excuse me, always down below. So please go and subscribe. <clears throat> excuse me subscribe to her channel um give her thummies uh send her loving messages because she really needs it right now her family is hurting so bad <sighs> so okay um so that's it for me um so thank you so much you guys you're all so so wonderful uh and i would love for you to show her how wonderful you really you are and uh, go give her some of that love that you give me okay i will talk to you guys later i love you all mm -hmm.